just as much. Really lean, keeping those glutes engaged by really pulling that pubic bone towards the belly button. Arms reach long overhead, so just a soft, natural bend into the elbow, not an aggressive bend. So the more the bend in the elbow, the more you're going to feel this in the triceps. The longer the reach of the arms, the more you're going to feel this in your lats. And you want to feel this in your lats because when your lats are in, turned on, you're going to feel more work in your abdominals. Inhale, reach. Exhale, pull and meet over the midline. Really lean your torso forward as you try to get up. This helps shift the weight in your glutes. So you're activating and using more of your glutes more than your quads. Weight stays in your heel. Now this transfer of weight is so great for your abdominals because it makes the left side work and then the right side work. And those neuromuscular connections have to be on point with communicating with each other. Exhale as you lift and stand tall. As you press those arms up, you're going to pull those shoulder blades down. So try to keep lots of space between your shoulders shoulders and your ears. Along with that exhale, you're going to really wrap the abdominals. So try not to flare the ribs out. So notice how my ribs stay stacked over the hips. Inhale down, exhale lift, and as you press up, shoulders down, abdominals engaged. This is one of my absolute favorite exercises because it just works everything. So it's an inhale as you fold yourself forward. Exhale, really wrap the abdominals as you lift the arms up towards your temples and then out wide. Hips stay even. So one hip is going to want to lift. You want to really control and pull the hips down so that both hips are perfectly parallel to the floor. Now this really works your abdominals, your hips, the posterior delts, and your back. So so good for posture.